Hello friends. Today we learn nested for loop in C programming. So we learn here how to print a different pattern in C programming. So we print here this pattern. Here we use I for row and J for column. So let's understand the nested for loop execution. Here I equal to 0, then I less than equal to 4. The condition is true. Here I we, we declare I initialized 0. So 0 is less than equal to 4. Condition is true. Then control pass to inner for loop. Here we also declare j equal to 0 and the condition will be checked j is less than equal to i. So condition is checked 0 is less than equal to 0. The condition is true. Then the star will be print here. So we print here star. Then j is incremented. So j will be 1. So control pass to the condition and the condition will be check 1 is less than equal to 0 that means j is less than equal to 0 the condition is false then control is passed to the new line so when control is passed to the new line it means i is incremented so i will be 1 here is very important to know that in the inner for loop when condition is false, then control pass to the new line. So I already 1, so condition will be check 1 is less than equal to 4. The condition is true, then control pass to inner for loop. So j is equal to 0, then 0 is less than equal to 1 will be check. Then condition is true, then on the second line or second row, the first star will be print. It means on first row, zeroth column, the star will be print. Then j is incremented, so incremented by 1, so j is 1 here and i is also 1 and it is true. Then control pass to the printf and the first row on first column, the star will be print. Then loop will be execute again so j is incremented so j will be 2 and condition will be check here 2 is less than equal to 1 so i is 1 and j is 2 so 2 is less than equal to 1 condition is false so control pass to the new line and i is incremented so here i is 2 then again condition will be checked, 2 is less than equal to 4. Condition is true, then control pass to inner for loop again. So here j is 0 and i is 2. So 0 is less than equal to 2, condition is true. Then print star on second row, 0 column, first star will be print. Then j is increment by 1, so 1 is less than equal to 2 condition is true then control pass to the printf and on the second row first column star will be print then loop will be execute again so j is incremented so here j will be 2 so condition will be check 2 is less than equal to 2 condition is true then control pass to the printf and on the third, on the second row, second column, the third star will be print. Then again execute loop, then j is incremented, here j is a 3. So condition will be check, 3 is less than equal to 2, it is false, then control pass to the new line. When control pass to the new line, so i will be incremented, here now i is 3. So 3 is less than equal to 4. Condition is true. Then in the inner for loop, j is 0. So 0 is less than equal to 3. Condition is true. Then on 
फोर्थ रो जीरोथ कॉलम फर्स्ट स्टार विल बी प्रिंट देन जे इज इन्क्रिमेंटेड जे इज वन सो वन इज लेस दैन इक्वल टू थ्री ट्रू तो सो सेकंड स्टार विल बी प्रिंट देन जे इज इन्क्रिमेंट अगेन सो टू टू इज लेस दैन इक्वल टू थ्री कंडीशन इज ट्रू देन थर्ड स्टार इज प्रिंट हि देन अगेन लूप विल बी एक्जिक्यूटेड सो जे इज थ्री एंड थ्री इज लेस दैन इक्वल टू थ्री कंडीशन इज ट्रू देन फोर्थ स्टार विल बी प्रिंट हियर आफ्टर दैट कंडीशन इज फॉल्स बिकॉज जे इज इन्क्रिमेंटेड एंड जे विल बी फोर हियर सो फोर इज लेस दैन इक्वल टू थ्री द कंडीशन इज फॉल्स सो कंट्रोल विल बी पास टू द न्यू लाइन देन नाव आ इज फोर सो फोर इज लेस दैन इक्वल टू फोर कंडीशन इज ट्रू देन जीरो टू आय J will be incremented and the star will be print here. So zero is less than equal to four. True, the first star. Then J is increment. So one is less than equal to four. Second star. Then two is less than equal to four. Then third star. Three is less than equal to three. Then fourth star. And last is a J. It's four, so four is less than equal to four. Condition is true. Then fifth star will be print here. Now J is five, so five is less than equal to four. Condition is false. Then cursor will be transferred to the new line. Then next I will be incremented. So here I is five, so five is less than equal to four. the condition is false and loop will be terminate here here note that again the inner for loop is inner for loop condition is false then control is pass to the new line and when outer for loop condition is false the loop will be terminate here thank you